Hello and welcome back to the Red Hipster Channel. It's me, John. Today I'll be trying a new ice cream flavor from Van Lea One. And this is another one of their collaboration flavors, similar to Kraft Mac and Cheese, the Grey Poupon, the Netflix Glass Onion, and which was bad, and the Hidden Valley Ranch, which was also bad. Um, mustard one was decent, but the mac and cheese one was delicious. Today's version, though, is a collaboration with Arizona. This is an Arizona green tea flavor. It also has honeycomb. Uh, they, they have a different flavor that's just honeycomb, which is very good. They also have a hot honey with honeycomb, which I tasted. Didn't think that the hotness came through enough. I wish there was more spice to it, actually. Um, but anyway, today, Arizona green tea. You know Arizona from the giant 99 cent cans that most likely aren't 99 cents anymore due to inflation. But without further ado, here we go and trying it out. Valley ones, Arizona green tea with honeycomb. I already removed the, uh, the lid there because I knew it was going to be difficult. You know, all those paper lids, sometimes they tear and stuff, so... I ruined it before, but as you can see, I have not tasted it yet. Here we go. Green tea. There's green tea ice cream that already exists, so this shouldn't be too weird. Mmm. Pretty good. Mm. I like it. Now, I've had a lot of matcha flavored ice cream. There's like mochi ice cream, which is like that ice cream that's been coated with the that gummy rice uh, starch. And I've always liked that. Now this is just green tea, which is technically a different thing than matcha. Um, green tea you can make just like uh, black tea. You put it, the green tea leaves in a bag, you steep it in water. Whereas matcha is like dried up, ground up uh, green tea leaves that you kind of whisk in. And it's a more creamier, cloudier uh, beverage. Now, of course, it's ice cream, so it is more cloudy. It's not clear like a, a steeped green tea would be. But the flavor profile does remind me a lot like matcha. Especially if you ever had like a matcha latte. That's a lot of the vibes I'm getting from this flavor. The little uh, crunchy bits of honeycomb are a very welcome addition to this. I do like when my ice creams from the pint have some additions to them besides just the one uh, consistency of ice cream. Whether that be like a swirl of either like caramel fudge or a fruity kind of swirl, or whether that be crunchy or chewy bits like a cookie dough, or in this case the the chewy honeycomb bits. <coughs> Excuse me. This is really good. Does it taste necessarily like Arizona tea? I don't know if I had an Arizona tea next to it to it to try out. I might let you know, but on the ingredients, it just says green tea as an ingredient. Um, I'm not sure if that means like a steep green tea or just like the green tea leaves were somehow used in here. 
There's also a ginseng root extract as well. Um, I'm not sure if that's to add flavor or whatnot. I'm not sure what ginseng has a definable flavor. I'll, I'll read you a little description about the Arizona part here. It says, Nothing makes us happier than this Arizona green tea ice cream. Only the greatest things hail from Brooklyn, New York, like Arizona and yours truly. So Arizona is from Brooklyn, New York, and not from Arizona? That's interesting. And the best style of pizza and the Dodgers. So we had to join forces with the iconic drink brand to create iconic ice cream with green tea and ginseng and honeycomb candy. Maybe Arizona green tea just have ginseng in them. That's why they added it. So I think they're trying to imitate the flavor profile or ingredients of Arizona. And maybe they use the same supplier of ginseng and green tea from Arizona. But I don't think they used specifically Arizona green tea that they made uh, and then instead of putting it in a can they use it in here I think they just use like the same ingredients but either way I like it it's good if you like green tea or matcha flavored ice cream then I think you'll like this the Van Leeuwen Arizona green tea with honeycomb I'm giving two thumbs up I recommend Especially if you like uh, tea flavored ice creams or just tea in general. It's a good flavor. I enjoy it. I think you will too. And until next time, don't forget to like and subscribe. Give this video a thumbs up. And I'll see you on the next video. Goodbye for now.